In calculus, the integral of any linear combination of functions equals the same linear combination of the integrals of the functions. This property is known as linearity of integration. It is a fundamental property of the integral that encapsulates in a single rule two simpler rules of integration. The sum rule and the constant factor rule. Linearity of integration is related to the linearity of summation, since integrals are thought of as infinite sums. Statement and derivation. Let f and g be functions. Now consider, by the sum rule in integration, this is by the constant factor rule in integration. This reduces to hence we have it is also possible to infer linearity of integration as a consequence of linearity of differentiation. Operator notation. The differential operator is linear. If we use the heavy side D notation to denote this, we may extend D minus 1 to mean the first integral. To say that D minus 1 is therefore linear requires a moment to discuss the arbitrary constant of integration. D minus 1 would be straightforward to show linear. If the arbitrary constant of integration could be set to 0, Abstractly, we can say that D is a linear transformation from some vector space V to another one. We know that D equals zero for any constant function C. We can by general theory identify the subspace C of V, consisting of all constant functions as the whole kernel of D. Then by linear algebra we can establish that D minus 1 is a well-defined linear transformation that is bijective on MD and takes values in V, C. That is, we treat the arbitrary constant of integration as a notation for a coset F plus C, and all is well with the argument.